Om Shanti, welcome back. Now we are doing the recording of 18th of August, Quali Blessing. Now here Supreme Father wants us to become a Befikar Bacha. What does that mean? A master creator? Somebody who doesn't have any kind of impact on their psyche because of the situations outside. That means worldly situations. So let's understand this easily. Godfather Vaya says, may you be a master creator. That means we are the creators of our own destiny. The choices which we make and if we make those choices with not just the head but also with the right kind of feelings. Now these feelings are, cannot be the feelings of sadness, hatred, jealousy or disdain or looking down upon somebody or uh, competition and comparison. These feelings have to be very pure. One has to feel complete. One has to feel joyous. One has to feel happy. One has to feel content in the present situation and also feel happy about what they're going to create in the future. And then the creation should carry forward. Then the thought should carry forward. This is what we're talking about. So God says, may you be a master creator and make an impact on the atmosphere. Now, it could be your job atmosphere, office. It could be your business office place. It could be your colleagues, your school, your college where you're teaching or where you are a student, could be a house, could be your NGO, could be any place, could be a hospital too. So God says, make an impact on the atmosphere by staying in the stage of a carefree emperor. Now, emperor decides, makes decisions, creates, thinks about everybody around. If the emperor himself gets perturbed, gets distant from people, having a mood swing, becomes stressful, becomes fickety. Think about that kind of emperor guiding you. Would you like to take his decisions and work them out and carry them out? Obviously not. Why? Because you understand that those decisions will not be fruitful and not bring back something good for the whole community or the whole kingdom. So here Godfather wants us to become a carefree emperor. Befikar Bacha. So the father has says that the father has such a big family and yet he is a carefree emperor. Supreme God father has a huge family of billions of souls and then next Dada that means Adam or Brahma has another one less out of billions of souls. Huge family. Then still with this kind of family, huge family while knowing and seeing everything he is carefree because he understands that every soul has a role to play and if he stays constant, doesn't get into a mood swing, because it doesn't get into any kind of fits of stress or of depression or anything, then he can help anybody and everybody to see the light at the end of the tunnel or at the end of the day. He can find out, he can guide people and make them see that what exactly needs to be done in this situation. Whereas if he himself, instead of being a carefree emperor, becomes stressful, becomes fidgety, becomes somebody who is going through a mood swing, complaining, blaming, criticizing, imagine getting guidance from that kind of personality. So father says, make an impact on the atmosphere and do not allow the atmosphere to make an impact on you because the atmosphere is created by you master creators. So whatsoever may be happening in that organization, in that society, in that community, in your house, in that, in that job place, in that school, in that hospital, whatsoever may be happening, the situation, being a master creator means first having control of your own thoughts. Making them peaceful instantly. This is what we learn in Brahma Kumari. It's not that you, when everybody is panicking, you sit down in a pose of meditation, crossing your legs and you say, wait a minute, let me meditate for a few minutes. No. We are always constantly in connection with the Supreme, constant meditation, constantly in connection with the infinite energy, with the source energy, with the powerful energy. And then we are constant in happiness, so we are able to take the choices and make the choices instantly. That's what he wants us to do. You creators have to make an impact on the creation. When any situation arises, remember... I am a victorious soul. Now this is something which I can use as an affirmation every single time. I am a victorious soul. 
I am always victorious in every situation. It doesn't matter what. If I am being impatient, if I am feeling worry, then I am going against my own destiny. I am sometimes sabotaging my own destiny. With this understanding, we can make choices right now itself. You will then constantly remain carefree by doing this and not to be afraid. So. we can be carefree in every situation and this is what we learn the carefree knowledge given at brahma kumaris by your brothers and sisters they are waiting for you in the white dresses to bring you and share with you the deeper finer edges of this knowledge without even asking you for a penny who does that in this world if you go out in the world for positive thinking their books you have to pay money for that for attending lectures sometimes you have to pay Three hundred, four hundred dollars in the Western countries. Think about free knowledge, higher than that, much more higher than that. What you have been getting out in the world, and it is an amalgamation of everything which you have heard in this world. Getting that for free. You attended, and then come back to me and let me know how did you feel. With this, Om Shanti.